All right, we have got rank one rewards for my boy Wesley now. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable ultimate team coins, check out mmoexp.com. Link in the description. Save 5% using code HABER. Sorry, the camera's pointing the wrong way. There we go. Uh, we've got rank one rewards. This is the day after. So if you're wondering why I've changed clothes, that is why. I'm actually going to start off with the three team of the week packs because these have been terrible for like all of the rank one rewards that I've seen anybody open. So I'm just going to skip through these really, really quick and uh, we're going to move on because, yeah, not great. Not great at all. But we're going to move on. Second three team of the week pack. What we got EA? Come on. No walkout again. I am skipping these. Like I said, they're not good. They're not good at all. I don't know who the best player you can even get realistically is from this week's team of the week. Um, but, yeah, I'm not. I'm just not feeling it, man. All right, third and final one. Who have we got EA? No walkout again. Brilliant. Just what you want. Good start. Cheers, EA. Marmouche, he's got full transfer list as well. All right, we'll just store those in the club. Okay, now we're on to the good packs. So we're going to start off with the 82 by 30 because it is an untradeable pack. Do we have a walkout? Yes, we do. It's going to be sent him in Spain. France, it is going to be Gioro. You want Spain there for Bon Matteo Putellas? It is a double. I've skipped it, but it was a double. Who is it going to be in there? Uh, Rodrigo, nice. That is, oh, Nunmench as well. Nunmench is worth a little bit. Uh, no, he's not. Never mind. Uh, Rodrigo, by the way, that's class. He is worth a good chunk of coins. Oh, he's untradeable duplicate. No way. That's pain. Oh, that is painful. We'll swap all of these over real quick. Um, there's no point keeping the lower rated cards in the SBC section. I don't think any of these sell for anything anyway. Um, there's no point keeping a lot of these because they just don't... That like 83s aren't that useful. I don't want to fill up his entire uh, dupe storage with 83s when he can get higher rated cards like 85s, 86s and whatnot. All right, we'll do the 84 and the 85 by 10 next. We do get a road to the knockout. Who is it going to be? I don't know if that was a walkout or not. I can't really tell. I don't think it is. I think it's Balogun. I don't know if he's a walkout or not. Uh, I can't tell because the blue at the back of the tunnel was like... It's not wasn't bright enough to really tell um 86 i assume yeah, he's a walkout there you go he did walk out uh balogun informed jonathan david tonali that's a great pack i don't know if flow balogun's worth anything i need to start using this feature where it's like it tells you the average price but i don't know where it actually is where's the average price feature i guess it's not there uh but balogun's worth what 20 not even 20k i think tonali's the most expensive card there about 45k so we'll take that uh, I don't think anyone else is worth anything there, unfortunately. Uh, we will store some of these in the club, I guess, and uh, swap them over. I'm doing, look at this, I'm doing account management. Look at me. We're swapping over 84s for less than 84s. I'm doing account management. Look at me. All right, here we go. 85 by 10 next. Come on, EA. We don't get a special card. That just feels like a Spanish sentiment. Never mind. Okay, it's Beth Mead. Not great. Double walkout at least. Double walkout. Okay, that's not ideal. Wait, it's not Beth Mead. Who's that? Bruno Fernandes, Foden. He's so tiny, I thought he was a woman. Oh, Phil Foden and Bruno Fernandes. Foden's good. Foden's worth a little bit. That's nice. Foden's worth coins. AA Neymar and Nico Williams as well. That's a pack and half. That is tradable too. So you've got Foden who's worth like... Foden's worth about 95k, I think, right? Neymar is worth... About 85k. I can't believe how cheap Neymar is these days. Nico Williams might be the most expensive out of all three of them. He actually is. That's crazy. But that is real nice. And then you've got Oberdorf and Mamadashvili, who will swap over for Raum and Gnabry. Uh, so we'll swap those two over and discard Raum and Gnabry. Right. 89 double and a base icon pack next. 89 double first. Here we go. No special card. Who is that? Who is that? Centre mid. Kevin De Bruyne. Not bad. 91? 90? I think he might be 90 rated. I'm not really sure. Um, Hergerberg is not great behind that, though. Hergerberg behind that is not ideal, but Kevin De Bruyne's all right. Kevin De Bruyne is not bad. And then, is she tradable? She is not. That is fodder in the dupe unassigned. Okay. This is what we, we open rank for one for right now. It's the base icon. Wesley said he really wanted Ronaldinho. Ronaldinho. Please, EA. Dinho. Does he at least have a hat? I can't see a hat on him. I couldn't see the hat on him, but he might have a hat. I'm not really sure. He, he, okay, he has got the hat. 92 Lev Yashin. The only saving grace is this might be your goalkeeper for literally the entire year. I actually imagine he'll probably be pretty good this year. I don't know what that Playstyle Plus actually is. Not ideal. It's not, it's not Ronaldinho. Uh, the Playstyle Plus he's got is Cross Claimer. 
Might be good if we get like a, a lengthy meta, but it's not terrible. He's worth like four or five hundred K, so it's actually not bad. Like I'm sat there a bit deflated because it's a goalkeeper. And I think goalies are always a bit deflating, but it really isn't that bad at all, to be honest. We'll open up his AT plus pack. Why not? Let's just see if we get something good. Imagine. No. Okay, fair enough. Well, they were rank one rewards and they were yeah, they were alright. Heroic season opener pack. Guaranteed base hero rated up to 87. Yeah, yeah, Torre would be lovely. Yap stamp as well. There's some good heroes rated up to 87. Let's just open it up and see what we get. I don't like the fact that the hero is not walked out here. I don't like that at all. I, uh, maybe because she's 89 rated, that's why she's walked out. I don't know. Patrick Guajaro and Mappy Leon, I think it was. I mean, the perfect link of dreams. The painful part is I actually already have Patrick untradeable now. Um, otherwise, I would have sold mine. But... Does that mean that I've got a really bad hero? Or are they just walking out because they're higher rated than the hero? I guess we'll find out. Yapstan would be incredible. You don't know where I'm from, dog! Oh, that is pain. 6-1. Can play cam left wing. Ugh. Terrible. Terrible. Clint Dempsey. What's he like? He's 25k. The rest of the pack's not terrible, but that is brutal. That is pain. That is that is just a lot of pain right there. All right, so uh, let's get rid of these lower rate cards, and I'll see you for the next pack. We have got some rank one rewards. These are on PC this time. Uh, so let's see what we are about to get for Raymond. Team of the Week pack number one is not great. These Team of the Week packs just aren't great. In Wait, who actually is that? Brazil left mid from... Oh, Martinelli actually is not bad. Martinelli's okay. 85 rated Martinelli. I feel like he's worth a little bit. I don't know if he's worth loads, but surely like 50k. Right? Yeah, about 50. Not bad. We'll take that. That's solid. Uh, they are tradable, so you'll take all the coins. But yeah, the team of the packs have not been great from literally all of the rewards that we've opened so far. Uh, we don't. We haven't had like a decent team of the week yet. Next one, no walkout again, unfortunately. It's going to be a centre mid from Denmark. It is stage... Don't think that's how you pronounce it, I'll be honest with you. But that's how it's spelled. It is Stage from Werder Bremen. Uh, he is, again, an 81 rated, worthless, 10k discard. The only saving grace is that these Team of the Week packs are practically 90k in the bag, roughly. Uh, three Team of the Week packs, 10k. So if you do get something worth something, like, you're happy. But I don't expect anything from the Team of the Week packs. I just don't. Yeah, no walkout again, unfortunately. Centre mid from Spain this time. From La Liga, it is Sergi Roberto, I believe, who was a left back at City and now he's a uh, centre mid, apparently, for uh, Real Sociedad. So, yes, uh, Sergi Gomez, Sergio Gomez. All right, fair enough. Not ideal. I think we had Ismaili in all three of them. That is pain, to say the least. But they're only the team of the week packs. We've got big packs to go yet. So it's not the end of the world. There's an 84 by 10, an 85 by 10, an 82 by 30, a base icon pack, an 89 double. I was testing my ball knowledge right there, but I'm pretty sure it's an 89 double. So there is nothing to worry about. We could still get some really, really good pack balls. All right. What's the opening next? He is going to go with the 82 by 30 here. No special card on the front. Oh my God. No walkout. I think that's Leroy Zane. Because I doubt it'd be 82 rated Nabry. That's rough, man. No walkout of 82 by 30. Yikes. We're not off to a good start at all here. We're really not. If you're wondering, by the way, I've just got back from football. That's why I look like an absolute mess right now. I look like a mess usually. But, like, I look like more of a mess now because I just got back from football. That's horrendous, by the way. That is a terrible 82 by 30. Like, ouch. Oh, he's got a walkout. He's just on the Team of the Week upgrade with the uh, dupes. He's got Cole Palmer. Nice. Cold Palmer. I don't know if Palmer's worth anything these days. Uh, yeah, he's just done. He's just done this with the uh, SBC storage because he ran out of SBC storage. Sixteen k, sixteen k. I mean, uh, to be fair, like I, yeah, all right, fair enough. I actually see why he's sixteen k, but it just feels like it's cheap. I don't know, the cold Palmer. All right, these are tradable now. Eighty four times ten. Come on, EA. We do have a walkout. It's going to be a sentiment Spain, France Gioro. Cat is fiddling with a pen on my desk. Uh, Gyoro, I didn't see if that was a double or not. It's not a double. I don't think Gyoro is worth anything, unfortunately. She had a really good card last year. I think it was a foot birthday, but uh, I haven't seen anyone use this card this year. So, oh, Romero was an RTTK as well. That's a shame. Um, not an amazing pack, unfortunately. 
Uh, let's see what else we got in there. We got an 85 times 10, an 89 times 2, and a base icon pack. 85 times 10 first. It is a walkout. Putellas, go on. I actually think it might be. That looked like Putellas. I'm not even joking. Like, that looks like Putellas. Wait. Did they change the double... I mean, let's go, by the way. What a pack that is. Oh, my word. She's like 700k. I don't... I'm really confused. Ronaldo in there as well. Saka in there as well. That is an absolute W. What an 85 times 10. I don't know why I'm so confused. I thought that she popped up first. I don't even know. Anyway, 89 double now. Let's see what this is going to be. Who is this? It's going to be a centre mid from Norway. It is going to be... Uh, the guard. So this is a double 89 pack, unfortunately. I don't know who's the best 89 rated card you can get behind this. Van Dijk? I mean, he's a he's a road to knockout anyway, so it can't be him. It's Hergerberg. It's a double Norway pack, but it's not the Norwegian you want. You want Haaland, and it's not Haaland, unfortunately. Uh, I guess it's decent fodder, but other than that, it's, you know, nothing more than a bit of decent fodder, sadly. But this is where it gets interesting. The base icon pack. Come on, EA. Cook for us, please. Show us the goods. I want to see if I can guess the silhouette. That looks like R9. It looks like Rooney, to be honest. It actually looked like Rooney. Like, I was joking about the R9, but I think it actually might be Wayne Rooney. It is Wayne Rooney. I'm sure that's Wayne Rooney. Wayne Rooney! Go on, Wayne Rooney. I can tell the hairline. I'm not going to lie to you. Is Rooney worth loads? Like, not loads. I feel like he's worth a little bit, though. Oh, my God. He's a million coins. I didn't realize he's a mil. Oh, my word. This card looks insane, by the way. This card looks ridiculous. He's got... Power shot plus, finesse shot, chip shot, long ball, relentless Traveller, acrobatic. He's advanced forward plus plus, false nine plus. And he can play shadow striker at cam. Wow, that is a great card. I mean, you absolutely take that. Those rewards were really good. All right, so we've got a deluxe RTTK week two pack next. Let's see what we get from this. No special card, unfortunately. Feels bad. It's going to be a right wing for England. Is that Bakayo? Big Bakayo. Oh, it could be Foden. Foden would be nice. Oh, no, I've already got Foden untradeable. What am I talking about? I already have Foden untradeable. we got Trent Alexander-Arnold and Phil Foden. I already have Foden untradeable, so it's like... It doesn't really matter to me. At all. He's just 88-rated fodder. Uh, it would have been nice. Oh, it's tradable! Oh, let's go! It's a tradable pack! What a W! Oh, nice! I'm not necessarily complaining about what? Oh, nice! All right, let me list all these cards up. Oh, yeah! 100k about... I reckon probably about 110k when everything's sold from that pack. So if I open it with coins, that's some juicy profit right there. Big trading methods right here. All right, we go again. Deluxe season opener packs now. I just want to get some special cards. I'd love to pack that Araujo, that Ronald Araujo. I think that card looks sick. CB from France. It's Renard. I can tell by the, the build, to be honest. She is, she is actually wham. She really is. Uh, who else is in there? Victor Osman. Osman and Renard. Anything else? Inform Brian Zaragoza. Uh, not a great pack again, unfortunately. Uh, we'll go ahead and discard a lot of these. I'm in 95 out of 100. I need to use some of my... Um, I need to use some of my SBC storage players. All right, we go again. Second deluxe season opener pack. Uh, no special card again. He's another walkout, though. Striker from Germany. Schiller. Definitely not pop. She's too small to be pop. That is Schiller. No double walkout either. It's pop. Konate is a great untradeable, though. Konate is, first of all, unreal in game. Second of all, if we get an Evo for him, even better. Um, aside from that, I mean, given the fact I only have two slots left, I'm going to have to discard these 84s. I might quickly go and pop a bunch of plays into an SBC. <laughs> pop, get it? <laughs> Shut up. All right, Team of the Week upgrade on my account. What we say in EA? Vinny J would be nice. Walk out? No. Okay. It's going to be centre mid from oh, his stage. I've got stage fright because this guy's in all of my packs.